Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Will from SC, and today we're going to introduce to you the best high school football players from each state in the class of 2023. These rankings are compiled from 247sports.com, as well as from each state's official all-state football team. As a reminder, please do not comment, you forgot Missouri, for example, as this is the first part of a two-part series, so this video will go from Alabama to Massachusetts. A couple weeks later, we will release part two, which will go from Michigan to Wyoming. As soon as part two is out, we will put that link to the video in the description below. Now, let's get into it. From the state of Alabama is 6'4 defensive lineman James Big Kong Smith. The five-star from Montgomery, Alabama has not yet committed, but has narrowed his top 11 schools to be Alabama, Jackson State, Miami, Georgia, Texas A&M, USC, Auburn, Florida, Ohio State, Texas, and Alabama State. It will be interesting to see if he decides to stay in state and play for either Alabama or Auburn, or go out of the state and attend Georgia. During his junior year, he attended IMG Academy for better competition. However, he said that nothing had changed and that he was doing the same thing there at the level that he was doing at his previous high school, Carver. He played in a few games, but quickly returned back to Carver. During his sophomore year, he helped lead Carver High School to a Alabama 6A first round playoff appearance. He is a physical defensive lineman with great size who is great against the run and as a pass rusher. The number two defensive lineman in the nation has been grinding hard and waking up at 4.30 a.m. every day since he was 12 in order to get a lift in. He intends to study engineering in college and will look to attend the same college as his high school teammate, Kwa Rusal, another five-star defensive edge, as Smith stated that there is a 70 to 75% chance that this will happen. From the state of Alaska is running back Pumanatagi Pau from Betty Davis East Anchorage High School. I struggled to find a player to hold this title as the state's Gatorade Player of the Year, Kyler Johnson, is from the class of 2022. As a result, I selected Powell due to the fact that he scored two touchdowns and converted a two-point conversion in the state championship game that resulted in a 30-17 East Anchorage victory over Juno. Earlier in the season, they suffered a 39-28 defeat to the same team. Although he wasn't the primary back, he will look to be the newest star of the team. If I'm wrong in this, please let me know in the comments below who you think is the best player in Alaska. From the state of Arizona is five-star tight end Deuce Robinson from Phoenix. Standing at 6'6", Deuce possesses superior athletic abilities as he has run a 4.7 40-yard dash and has a 35.6-inch vertical jump. The highest rated tight end in his class appears to be set to commit to play under head coach Lincoln Riley at USC. However, it appears he is also interested in playing at Georgia and Clemson. At Pinnacle High School, he got off to a great start as he played varsity in his first year of ever playing tackle football. He has been compared to current Raiders tight end Darren Waller due to his tall stature and broad frame. He has a smooth route running ability and the athleticism to make spectacular catches. His burst off the line of scrimmage and subsequent speed make it difficult for any defender to keep up with him. He is a two-sport athlete as he is a standout baseball player and holds offers from some of the top schools, including Oregon, Oregon State, and Stanford. His father, Dominic Robinson, was also a former five-star recruit and played receiver for the Florida State Seminoles in the early 2000s. Deuce has been praised for his down-to-earth attitude and overall willingness to continue to improve his craft. Four-star tight end Shamar Easter is the top recruit from Ashdown, Arkansas. In August of last year, Easter committed to play for head coach Sam Pittman at Arkansas. He's also a standout in basketball and in track and field. His high school coach described him as a man among boys and was so dominant during middle school that Arkansas offered him before he even played a down of varsity football. He possesses incredible speed and has the ability to get separation and make some pretty impressive catches. During his junior season at Ashdown, he caught 30 passes for 519 yards and 5 touchdowns. He currently runs a 4.62 40-yard dash and will only continue to improve on his acceleration.
The top recruit from California is six foot three quarterback Malachi Nelson. The five star out of Los Alamitos announced his commitment to USC this past November. Malachi had previously been committed to Oklahoma but followed Lincoln Riley once Riley agreed to become the 30th head coach of the USC Trojans. The second highest rated recruit in his class threw for 39 touchdowns and nine interceptions, leading Los Alamitos to a nine and two record and a Sunset League championship. He is an accurate passer with elite arm talent. In addition, he has the ability to extend plays outside the pocket and takes off with the ball as his last option. Recently, it was reported that Nelson will agree to nearly a million dollars worth in NIL endorsement deals by the time he enrolls at USC. He signed a deal with the H. Wood Group, a global hospitality firm, to hook him up with endless marketing opportunities. He said that he has been careful about accepting deals and wants to accept those that align with his beliefs and that he can connect to and be genuine in putting out. He looks forward to learning under current USC quarterback Caleb Williams, and he is expected to be the full-time starter in time for the 2024 season. From Colorado is four-star edge rusher Blake Purchase from Englewood. He appears set to sign with Iowa State, but still has interest in Pac-12 schools, including California, Oregon, and Colorado. His brother Miles currently plays cornerback at Iowa State and will most likely be the deciding factor in Purchase's decision. During his junior year at Cherry Creek High School, Purchase recorded 83 tackles, 12 sacks, and two interceptions, while leading the team to a Colorado 5A state title. He has won the state title every year with Cherry Creek and looks to finish his senior season the same way. In addition to football, he also plays basketball, where he averaged 12.5 points and 5.6 rebounds last season. Standing at 6'2", Purchase possesses superior athletic ability that allows him to rush the passer with ease. While his decision is still very much up in the air, I expect him to commit this summer. Six foot six offensive tackle and long snapper Miles Walker is the top recruit from Connecticut. The three star from Greenwich is currently uncommitted, but he appears interested in Ohio State, Duke, and Penn State. He had originally been under recruited as he received his first offer from Massachusetts back in September of 2020, but had to wait for more than a year and a half before the major Power 5 offers flooded in. He's a player with a lot of potential as he continues to shed body fat, gain strength, and become more mobile on his feet. From Delaware is 6'5 edge rusher Desmond Aladouche. The three-star from Milford Senior High School announced his commitment to play for head coach Mike Elko at Duke. He had received 24 total offers before announcing his commitment including from schools such as Boston College, Air Force, and Navy. He'll be a force on Duke's defensive line as the Blue Devils look to become competitive in the ACC once again. The top recruit from Washington, D.C. is edge rusher David Ojebwe from St. John's High School. In late April, Ojebwe announced his commitment to play for head coach Dabo Sweeney at Clemson. He chose the Tigers over Michigan, UNC, Miami, and Maryland. At Clemson, he will be joined by former St. John's teammate Trey Williams, who was instrumental in recruiting the 2023 prospect. He finished his junior year with 14 sacks as he helped lead the cadets to an undefeated season and a WCAC title. The 6'3 four-star has a lot of potential and he will only continue to improve as he gets stronger and faster. Out of the state of Florida is five-star cornerback and receiver Cormani McLean. The highest rated cornerback in his class, McLean is expected to stay in state and commit to play for Billy Napier at Florida. However, it appears he is still interested in schools such as Alabama and Ohio State. He originally started his high school career as a receiver, but was put into action at cornerback due to an injury to a fellow teammate. During his sophomore year at Lake Gibson High School, he totaled nine interceptions and then added 10 more the next season. He has been laser timed as running a 4.5 40 yard dash. He is very shifty and has the ability to break on the ball at any time. The top player from the state of Georgia is five star safety Caleb Downs. During his junior year at Mill Creek, the number one safety in his class recorded 77 tackles, 11 pass breakups, and five interceptions two pick sixes, as well as eight touchdowns on the other side of the ball. 
Although he's currently uncommitted, his top three appear to be Georgia, Ohio State, and Alabama. The multi-sport athlete also plays basketball and baseball and is a member of the National Honor Society. Caleb comes from one of the most athletic families in the nation, as his dad, Gary, was a running back for the New York Giants. His brother, Josh, is a star receiver for UNC, and his uncle, Drew Bly, was a two-time Pro Bowl cornerback and is the current cornerbacks coach at UNC. Downs is one of the most athletic players in his class, and this athleticism allows him to make the right cuts on the ball. He spends hours watching film in order to identify trends and utilize this knowledge on the field. Six foot one linebacker and receiver Lyona Lafau is a top recruit from Hawaii, the four star from Kahuku, committed to play for Steve Sarkeesian at Texas a few days ago. Lyona chose the Longhorns over Utah and Oregon. The rangy, versatile defender will join the number one rated player in the country, quarterback Arch Manning, in Austin. He said that going from Hawaii to Texas allows him to blaze his own path and do something different. Also runs the 100 meter dash and the 4x100 relay for the school's track team. Six foot three athlete Kenyon Sadiq is a top recruit from Idaho. During his junior year, he hauled in 79 catches for 1,166 yards and 19 touchdowns helping lead the Grizzlies to the Class 4A title. He has recently been on several official visits with schools including Washington State, Iowa State, Washington, and Michigan, according to On3.com. They predict he will most likely commit to either Iowa State or Michigan. Kenyon is also dominant in track as he's been recorded as running a 10.8 second 100 meter dash. He is regarded as a jack of all trades who can play linebacker, safety, tight end, and receiver with ease. The top recruit from Illinois is four-star offensive and defensive tackle Charles Jagusa from Alamond High School in Rock Island. The six-foot-six prospect is projected to sign with Notre Dame and play under head coach Marcus Freeman at Alamond High School. Charles also stars on the wrestling team, finishing with a 41-0 state championship season his junior year. Despite weighing nearly 300 pounds, he is light on his feet and possesses great athleticism. He has been known to be a very aggressive and physical player who will only continue to get better. Jagusa actually played soccer and basketball growing up and didn't start playing football until the 7th grade. Four-star linebacker Drake Bowen is the top recruit from Indiana. The 6'2 athlete has been a force at Andrian High School, recording 105 tackles, 3 sacks, and 3 interceptions at linebacker, and 965 yards and 18 touchdowns as a running back. He did all this while leading Andrian to a Class 2A state title. He finished with 80 tackles, 5 sacks, and 4 forced fumbles during his sophomore season. In November of 2021, Bowen committed to stay in state and play for head coach Marcus Freeman at Notre Dame. Drake is a multi-sport athlete who is dominant not only on the gridiron but the baseball diamond as well. He is ranked as Indiana's 8th best player in his class and the 2nd best shortstop in the state leading the team with 28 stolen bases. He had always dreamed of playing in both the NFL and MLB, and he is poised to play both sports for the Fighting Irish. On the field, he is a great linebacker who is explosive off the ball and is great in pursuit. The top recruit from Iowa is five-star, six-foot-seven offensive tackle Caden Proctor out of Des Moines. This past fall, he helped lead Southeast Polk to a Class 5A state championship victory. The highest ever ranked recruit out of Iowa is predicted to stay in state and sign with the Iowa Hawkeyes. He recently announced his top two were between the Hawkeyes and Alabama, and he appears intent on making his decision soon. He has great length and size to be a longtime starter in the NFL, and he already has garnered comparisons to stars such as Tristan Wirfs and Trent Williams. He possesses huge upside and a great work ethic that could see him as a future first round draft pick. Four star quarterback Avery Johnson from Mays High School is the top recruit from Kansas. Johnson announced he will commit on July 5th and many sources believe he will stay in state and play for head coach Chris Kleiman at Kansas State. His top three is down to Kansas State, Oregon and Washington. However, one of his closest friends, four-star running back Dylan Edwards, 
recently committed to play for the Wildcats, and I believe he will most likely join him. During his junior year at Mays, he finished with over 3,500 yards and 42 total touchdowns. The dual sport athlete was the leading scorer on his basketball team, leading them to a 23-2 record and a Kansas 5A state championship. Avery is a true dual threat quarterback with incredible speed and playmaking ability. He has been timed running a 4.5 40-yard dash. The top recruit from Kentucky is 6'5 defensive lineman William Spencer from Louisville. The four-star from Louisville Male High School appears ready to commit and stay in state and play for head coach Mark Stoops at Kentucky. He also holds offers from schools such as Louisville, Georgia Tech, and Michigan State. He is a big physical lineman who will be a force at whatever school he ends up at. Five-star, six-foot-four quarterback Arch Manning is the top recruit from the state of Louisiana. Manning, the highest rated recruit in his class and arguably one of the biggest names in sports at the moment, has finally cleared the air and committed to play for head coach Steve Sarkeesian at Texas. The nephew of NFL star quarterbacks Eli and Peyton Manning, Arch decided on Texas over Georgia, Alabama, LSU, Clemson, and Virginia. He is the star at Isidore Newman High School in New Orleans, throwing for 5,731 yards and 72 touchdowns in his first three years of high school. The landing of Manning was huge for the Longhorns, who wrapped up their 2021 campaign with an abysmal 5-7 record that included a home loss to Kansas. He is a mobile quarterback with a strong arm. He also has a perfect rating on 24-7 sports, just the seventh recruit ever to have this honor. His recruitment was kept as quiet as possible, but his decision will have a big impact on the college football world. Six foot two quarterback Eli Soren is the top prospect from Maine. The 2021 Maine Gatorade Football Player of the Year finished his junior season at Oxford Hills with more than 2,800 total yards and 33 total touchdowns, leading the Vikings to the Class A state championship game. Soren was named a first team punter and second team defensive back in the Class A division. The top recruit from the state of Maryland is six foot five athlete Nicole's Harbor. The highest rated athlete in his class is currently uncommitted, but according to On3, he's expected to commit to the University of Maryland. His top seven includes Michigan, USC, Miami, UMD, Georgia, LSU, and South Carolina. Harbor plays on both sides of the ball, including at tight end, edge, and linebacker. During his junior year, he finished with 17 sacks, 6 forced fumbles, and caught 16 passes for 290 yards and 5 touchdowns. He is a multi-sport star at Archbishop Carroll, as he ranks as not only one of the best football players, but one of the best sprinters in the country. During his junior year, he recorded a 10.28 second 100 meter dash and a 20.79 second 200 meter, which is double. This time puts him at 4th all time at the high school level. Brian Don, a recruiter from 24-7 Sports, stated that he's a dynamic talent with huge upside because of his development possibilities. He plans to run at the Paris 2024 Summer Olympics. The top recruit from Massachusetts is five-star offensive tackle Samson Akunlola from Brockton. The highest rated Massachusetts prospect in the modern era is currently uncommitted but appears to be the most interested in colleges such as Michigan State, Alabama, and Miami. He has great size and length that allows him to have success on both sides of the ball. He is a multi-sport athlete as he won the New England wrestling title as a junior and has also fared well in shot put. His brother Samuel currently plays defensive lineman at the University of Pittsburgh. Samson earned the nickname Pancake Honcho for his affinity for pancake blocks. That'll do it for the video today. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If we got any of our players wrong, please let me know in the comments below and part two will be coming out soon. Thank you.